Yo, what it do, YouTube? It's your boy, Coast Talk, and we are back with some sad news. Um, I'm pretty sure maybe you guys have noticed uh, it's been trending all over Coast Nation, um, but it has been recent news update earlier today that unfortunately Jack Doyle has sustained an um, undisclosed injury, which was earlier, but now sources say that he has had a kidney injury. Um, this injury may have come, uh, this happened on Sunday, uh, the recent game we just played against the Dolphins. Uh, we did win, but uh, I feel like the injury came that at the fourth quarter when Kiko Alonso uh, came in with the, the tackle, and there was a few people, others, a few other players that came in with the gang tackle as well that came down on Doyle. Um, he did get back up, but he did walk off after that. Um, he had to be hospitalized later on the day, um, but the surgery and everything went well, Coach Frank said. Um, but he has been injured and he's going to be placed on IR and he's going to have to have season ending injury. This is now a season ending injury and he will no longer be active for the rest of the season. Um, but the upside of this is we still have Eric Ebron, Mo Ali Cox, and Hewitt on the roster that are still productive and can get the job done. Uh, no one will have the blocking ability of Jack Doyle. Um, his season stats were 26 receptions, 245 receiving yards. Um, he averaged 9.4 per touch, and um, he had two touchdowns, and one of the touchdowns was against the Dolphins, um, which was it was pretty it was pretty heartbreaking to hear the injury of Jack Doyle. No one season's coming. I didn't even know he was really hurt that bad, um, but it is a kidney injury. Um, we wish nothing but the best for Jack Doyle. I mean, he's a hometown hometown player from Indianapolis. Um, so I hope he heals fast and um, he recovers and come back as soon as possible. Um, him and Eric Ebron was a great duo for tight ends. Uh, we did have the best tight end set. Uh, I know earlier in the season, I, will always, I had that video when I said, who would you go with either Jack Doyle or Eric Ebron? Most people would prefer Ebron with his catching ability and he has been on a tear. Um, he is the best tight end or touchdown wise in the NFL, um, but others will say Eric Jack Doyle because of his blocking ability and what he can do with the run and help, and he can catch the football as well. Uh, he was a pro brother last year, but unfortunately his season he came to an end early. There's only a few weeks left in the season, but we definitely needed him in this stretch. Uh, but like I said, again, hashtag get well Jack Doyle, or you can just hashtag Jack Doyle in the comment section. Thanks for everybody for coming through. This is a quick video. Uh, it's your boy Coast Talk um, signing out. Peace.